all right hello and welcome back to my channel so today is exciting because I have been waiting to film this video for a long long time today I'm doing my baby shower haul I had my baby shower last weekend I was 34 weeks pregnant and I'm currently 35 weeks pregnant as I am filming this but we had a drive-by shower and I'll put some pictures up here um, of the shower and we got very lucky it rained that whole weekend but it stopped raining just in time for our shower um but so i had a drive-by shower and then a few days later i had a work shower that my work threw for me so we are very blessed we got lots of things for our baby and i think that she'll be set for a while one thing i also forgot to mention is that at our drive-by shower we did do a diaper raffle so if someone brought a box of diapers, their name went into a drawing and they had a, we had, we gave away two $25 gift cards to Kroger and Walmart. And as you can see, we are stocked up on diapers. Um, I mean, our closet is, the top of our closet is full of diapers. So really happy we did that. Um, and you know, if she grows out of a size and we haven't opened the box, then we can just take it and exchange it for a bigger size. So I did want to mention that definitely a good idea um in a great way to get stocked up on some diapers so i kind of categorized things not really i mean there was just so much stuff that it was kind of difficult to try to categorize everything so i'm just going to kind of run through things clothes i'm not going to show just because she got a lot of clothes and i think that that would just probably be boring just to show a bunch of clothes i will show a couple things that were like my favorites okay so let me start with pillows we have a lot of pillows <laughs> So, one thing I got that I was really excited about is the Boppy pillow. I do plan to breastfeed, and I'm hoping that this will work out well for us. And I think you can also use it for, like, tummy time and stuff. So, but I saw this print, and I thought it was perfect. And I also got the Snuggle Me Organic, which I'm really excited about that. It's an infant lounger. Um, and I didn't know though that these didn't come with a cover, like it's got a color on it or the color, um, gumdrop is what we got. Um, but it doesn't come with a cover that you can like remove and wash. So I did get a gift card and I went to order that and that should be here soon. Um, but I figured I should get a cover just in case she pees or poops on it or something. I can just remove that and put it in the wash. Okay, and then the last pillow that we got is the Snuggle, what, no, Boppy Lounger. There's too many, I can't keep up. And I got it in this pink flower print. So that way she can have something to sit up in. So she's got something to lay in, something to sit up in. She'll have plenty of options for sure. We also got the Bumbo floor seat. So I figured this would be good to, you know, just sit her up in if I can sit her up on the table while we're eating or on the counter maybe while I'm cooking. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But I figured that would be nice to have. And we also got this humidifier. I just picked like, I think it's the Target brand. I don't know. Safety first. I don't know. But um, I just picked like a simple one to go with. And I don't really know. Soothe baby with moisture rich air. I don't use a humidifier, but I remember I had one growing up and my mom would always turn it on whenever we were sick and stuff and it always comforted me so much. And it brings back like comforting good memories. So I definitely wanted to have one of these for our baby. My sister got this, what is it? Like a tummy time thing? A kick and play piano gym. Oh, here's a better picture from the back. So, it's like a tummy time mat, and you can also put it, put the baby on their back, and they can kick the little piano keys with their feet. And then as they get older, you can remove the piano part, and they can play with it just as the piano. So, this they can use for a while, I think. Up to 36 months is what it says. So, that's very nice. Ooh. This I'm so excited about. We got the Hatch Sound Machine, Hatch Rest Sound Machine. 
and I was so excited for this. I've been waiting to open it. I haven't opened anything because I wanted to film this video. So today is my busy day. Like I'm going to start washing clothes. I'm going to start unboxing things, getting things organized in her nursery. So I'm so excited to finally open in, open things up. So since I, that was a technology thing, I'll just do other technology. I don't know if I have any more. Um, we also got this video, the baby monitor. It's a VTech five inch smart Wi-Fi video monitor. So it hooks up to your phone. I guess it comes with an app. And then you can also use like this five inch um, monitor. And let's see, it's high definition. It's got a built in night light, which I do like that. And it has a wide angle viewing up to 110 degrees. But see, I also, let me see. I also got this one from my work shower so I got two different ones this one I don't think that you can hook up to your phone it does have night lights oh it has a glow on the ceiling projection light so this one has different features but I do like how this one hooks up to your phone and I don't know I don't think I would need two cameras but I'm gonna like do my research on them and see which one I think I like better if you have used either one of these Leave a comment below and let me know how you liked it. And maybe that'll help me make a decision on which one I can use. We got these Tommy Tippy bottles. I had heard about these, but I had never like looked into them. My stepmom got these for me and her daughter had used them. And she said how they can grow with your baby. Like they can turn into toddler sippy cups and stuff. So I thought that was pretty cool. So we'll definitely get some use out of those. So while we're on the feeding category, we also got these Dr. Brown's Natural Flow bottles, anti-colic. And the person who bought these for us, she said she accidentally got the preemie nipple. So I'll have to get new nipples, which all of that's new to me. I didn't even know there was different types of nipples for ages and stuff. So we'll have to get some new nipples, but they have little flowers on them and I thought they were cute. And we got the Haka. Um, silicone breast pump so like I said I am hoping to breastfeed so hopefully this will come and use maybe build a supply while my baby is feeding on one side I can use this on the other side to catch the letdown so no milk goes to waste that's liquid gold very important so I'm very excited to try and use that and I also got um, breast milk storage bags just the Target brand so hopefully I can build up a supply. And while we're on the feeding category, my sister has, oh my gosh, she is awesome. So she made me handmade, she sewed, she had sewn me handmade burp cloths. And she has her little tag on here, it says made by Macy Ann. And on the back, it's like a terry cloth material. And I have so many. Actually, she made me some out of, she made me some out of reusable diapers, cloth diapers. <laughs> um, but she said she liked this material better because it's more like flimsy and stuff, but just the terry cloth. And she made me several designs. So I have the flowers and kitty cats because she knows I'm a cat lover. And... Oh, these are adorable. And also these rainbows. Just a terry cloth. So I, I think I'm good on burp cloths. I don't know how many you use, but I think I will be set. So, and I just thought that was so special. Like these are things that hopefully if they don't get ruined that I'll keep forever. Just because they are handmade by my baby's aunt, my sister. And she also made me like loveys, I think is what they're called. So like a little security blanket and it's this really soft material on the back and it's got this little button that she put on there. So I guess you can put like a stuffed animal or a pacifier or something or teether. So at, at the same prints, I think the rainbow flowers and the kitty cat so my sister has been busy at work and this is just so special so i will definitely treasure these and they'll definitely get used for sure oh my aunt actually made me homemade birth cloths too so 
my family is just so creative. I feel like I'm going to start getting like all over the place just because it's a mess in here. I'll try to post a picture of what the room looked like before I got into everything and <sighs> stressful. I had a massage this morning. Oh, it was so relaxing. I left there just feeling great. And then I walk into this nursery and I'm like, oh my gosh, it's just the stress just came right back. So, <laughs> um, we got a carrier. This is the Infantino four in one carrier. You can use it. It says from eight to 32 pounds. I also have like a wrap, um, kind of like the wild bird wrap I got from a yard sale. But I just figured that my husband maybe wouldn't want to use that. And this will probably be easier and more practical for him. And maybe better for walks and stuff. So I think that'll be really good for us to use. Oh, I did forget one technology thing. I'm crazy. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. We got the outlet sock from my work. I, I put this on my registry, but I was not expecting anybody to buy it. I just put it on there, you know, just in case, and we got it. So, I wanted it, you know, just in case. You know, we are first-time parents, and I feel like I might be a little anxious about, you know, her sleeping and napping and stuff. I don't know. I feel like I'm probably going to be anxious about it. So, I figured, you know, this would help both of us ease our anxiety a little bit, um, and just make sure that she is safe when she's sleeping and we know that she's okay. So I'm so, so happy that we got it. So the outlet sock, and then it came with the different um, sizes, I guess. And it came in like this sea green color. So that way it will grow with her. So, oh my gosh, I was so excited. I can't believe I forgot that. This is like the biggest technology item. And I got a nursing tank top cami which I was really excited about because it's just one less thing that I'll have to go out and buy for myself you know I know that this is going to come in handy just I can wear this around the house just pull it off real quick I don't have to wear a bra with it I'm not I don't think so it feels like there's one in there so super happy about that I got an extra set of crib sheets this pretty leaf color so it'll be nice to have an extra one of those just when she's older and she sleeps in the crib in case there's a mess That'll be nice to have. And this diaper organizer. So I put this on my registry so that I can have a nice organized place next to my bed. Um, you can put wipes on one side, diapers on the other, like diaper rash creams and stuff right here. And then in this pocket, take this out. It is a changing pad that you can, I guess, set on the bed or wherever you're at. And just change her and it's like you can just wipe it off if a mess gets on it you know I don't know what people do in the middle of the night when they change their kit I don't know if they just you know put them on the bed I don't know if I'll use this but we're gonna figure it out but I figured it might come in handy and then it just slides right back in there so we have a nice organized spot to keep everything I registered for these these cube organizers. I have a cube cube shelf in my closet, in the nursery closet, and I registered for three of these. So that way we can just throw things in there. Um, it can make the shelf look more organized. Shoes, wipes, I don't know what we'll put in here, but they will be good to have. And these are from Target. They're just a pretty little pink color. So I got three of those. And we got a, the giraffe wubba nub, which these are so soft. I felt one of these. I think I felt the cat one. I was given one from somebody at work and it's so soft. I'm like, I want to lay this thing on my chest. So I think our baby will definitely love that. And she has plenty of pacifiers. We got, what are these? The itsy ritzy ones, the pink ones. And we probably have, I don't know, four or five packs of these Avent ones, the Phillips Avent. So hopefully she likes them, but she is set on past fires for sure. And I was given this um, Johnson's Discovery bath set. And it's got a little bit of everything in it. It's got lotions, wipes. Um, oh my gosh, the cute little cotton swabs. And diaper rash cream. 
So just a little bit of everything to try. So that'll probably last a while with how much you use with the baby. And this, I didn't register for, but um, the person just gave it to me, which she has a five month old, I believe. So I'm assuming that her baby uses this, which I thought was a good idea to get somebody something that you know your baby enjoys and likes. But it is this little, I guess, tummy time like activity mat. And it's like got fish in it. And it has these holes so you can fill up the inside up with water. And then the baby can just play with it and move these fish around. So I thought that was such a good idea. And like I said, I didn't register for it, but I'm excited to use it. Since I touched on that little bath set, I have a ton of bath stuff here that I'm just going to go ahead and go through. We got these waterproof changing pad liners from the Munchkin brand. And I figured those would be good to just set on top of the diaper changing cover that we have. That way we don't ruin it because it's, I think it's from Caden Lane or Copper Pearl. So it's a nice one. So that way hopefully this will prevent her from having accidents on the actual cover. And we have this hair rinse cup. You know, they have like the whale and stuff that you can um, buy for that. And this one is pretty cool though. It's got the rubber or silicone. I don't know what that is. It's very flexible. So, you know, if you put it on their head, it's not going to be uncomfortable or anything for them. So that just rinse their hair out with that. And we got this grooming kit. It's got a little bit of everything in there. Don't know what all we'll use out of it. I'm new to everything, but it'll be good to have just in case. I got more Johnson's, what is this, body wash, wash and shampoo, and then two things of lotion. Big one and the little one. And a six piece towel set. So it's got some towels and washcloths in there. And another, this is a hooded towel. I think those were two. A hooded towel. And these are organic washcloths. They're very soft. And then these were cute too, these little washcloths. They have whales, they're pink and blue. They kind of remind me of like Simply Southern or something, but those were cute. And we were given this nail care set. So some nail clippers and nail files. The baby bum brush. That'll be nice to have. And I had told my mom and my aunt about this and they were like, oh my gosh, I have never heard of such a thing. That's just crazy. Just slap it on and go on. I'm like, times have changed, okay? Now you use a baby bum brush. And the nose Frida, which they also thought was crazy. Oh my gosh, I would never use that. That's disgusting. There's a filter. So just suck up the boogers. The filter will not get it in your mouth. I'm actually excited to use that. And I had registered for this on Amazon. It's an electric nail trimmer. And I think it has a light on it, but it's by the band, band, the brand Baby Eloge. So I was really excited to get that. I got two bottle brushes. This one suction cups like to the inside of your sink and it just sticks out and then you can just like stick the, um, the cup in there. So it makes it easy to wash. And then this one actually has a stand. So I guess you can just like set it up on your counter and leave it on there. And we got some butt paste, much needed. And then this, what everything was sitting in. We got this big bathtub. Skip Hop is the brand. Skip Hop Moby, which I had actually looked on one of my friend's baby registries because she's also pregnant and she had this bath on there. And I was like, oh my gosh, that's so nice. It's really cool because it has this hook on the back. So you can just hook it up in the bathtub or like on the wall of the bathtub to save space and it it can grow like with your baby let me see if I can show you so you know you start them out in a sling in here and then as they grow they sit in there by themselves in the water and you don't have to fill up your entire bathtub like that one that has the holes in it that's really popular you know you have to fill up your whole bathtub just to get some water in there this is a bathtub in itself and it's cute, it's a whale. <laughs> um, so you don't have to fill up the whole bathtub, which will be nice. And you can probably 
I like this all the bathtub also because you can put it on we're planning on just putting it like in our on our kitchen counter um when we bathe her at first because that way we don't our bathroom the spare bathroom is really small so this we can just bathe her in the kitchen while she's little thank heavens for this I got the freedom mom peri bottle and I know they gave you one at the hospital but I think this one just looks like it makes more sense and looks like it's easier to use so I think this will definitely come in handy I wouldn't say I'm excited to use it I'm more worried about postpartum than I am birth so but hopefully this makes that a little bit easier all right and I got this big basket of goodies this isn't all from the same person I kind of just threw stuff in here but we got a bunch of receiving blankets and I think that's what these are too just a bunch of different receiving blankets. We got some bibs, just different ones, some rattles. I'm just gonna kind of go through these quickly just because it's nothing super like interesting. We got these uh, hot spoons, white hot spoons, so that when we start feeding her, um, if it's too hot, the spoon turns white. So you know, it's too hot for your child. Oh my gosh, like I said, so many pacifiers. Event, event, event. What are these? More itsy ritzy, so she's good. I think, I hope, we'll see. And speaking of pacifiers, I got these, um, what are they? Pacifier wipes. So I guess like if you're out and you drop the pacifier on the ground, you can just wipe it off with this. If you're not near a bathroom and you can't rinse it off or something, I got two packs of those. And I, from my drive-by shower, I was thinking, like, I'm not a big bow person. I don't go overboard with the bows. But after my drive-by shower, I was like, oh my gosh, I didn't get any bows. I'm like, I need, she needs some bows, but everybody's going to think she's a boy. And then I had my work shower. And one of my coworkers got me this cute little stand that you can display the bows on. And it has just these cute different ones on there. So now I have bows and a place to display them. So that was perfect. And my coworker got me this battery fan from Amazon. My baby is due in May. So it'll be getting hot. Um, and I plan on walking her a lot in the stroller. So this way I can like wrap the fan around the stroller and it hopefully, you know, won't be too hot for her. I can just blow the fan right on her or me, whichever. So I was excited about that. And I got this Skip Hop Portable Baby Soother, which you can also strap on the stroller. I don't know how, like, how many sounds it comes with. It plays four melodies and nature sounds and lullabies. Shoot, I'll use this to put me to sleep. <laughs> and it's actually a lot bigger than I thought. Like, seeing it online, I thought it was small, but it's, like, the size of my hand. So, I'm so excited to use all this stuff, though. And my mom got me this baby book because she noticed after my shower that I didn't get a baby book. So, she ordered this one for me on Amazon. And then, um, this basket, which one of my coworkers put my gifts in. And baby girl got lots of socks. Just different, like, little booties. Packs of socks. These cute little shoes. Oh my gosh. I can't wait until she's here. That makes me so excited. I'm 35 weeks. So, I mean, when I turned 35 weeks, I was like, oh my gosh. Like, she kind of could come at any time now. It's kind of scary. All right. And like I said, my aunt had also made me some burp cloths. So, here's the prints that she made. Little pink polka dots and hearts. Y'all think I'm good on burp cloths? Oh, and my aunt also made me these cute little stuffed animals. She knit these together. How freaking cool is that? Little teddy bear. And this one is so cute. A lion? She knit that. That is insane. Little tail. Oh my god. Like, that's so special. And that's something that, you know, will keep forever. It's so, so special. And um, this shopping cart cover, you know, with Corona going on. And I'm already kind of a germaphobe. Like, even if Corona wasn't going on, 
I would probably still get one of these because I don't really want my baby touching all the germs that come on a shopping cart. But it's like in the alphabet print. And she got lots of blankets. This is a quilt. Another little blanket. Um, and there's two really special blankets. Let me go grab them real quick so I can show you. Did I say two? I meant like three or four. So one of our family members mailed us this one. It's so soft and it's got her name all over it. I'm showing her name. I'm not trying to hide it because everybody, we've already announced her name. But her name is Daisy. And I thought this might be a cute one to take to the hospital for a picture or something. And it's really soft. <sighs> Hang on, let me catch my breath. My aunt also made this little quilt. Let me move up some. It has daisies all over it. It's like a baby size quilt. Daisies all over it. And my granny um, that passed away years ago, she loved hummingbirds. So she also put hummingbirds on there. And she said, well, I ran out of fabric for the daisies. So I figured the hummingbirds. And I said, no, that's perfect. Because we're, she's named Daisy after my husband's grandma. And her middle name is after my grandma which love the hummingbirds. So it just, it went perfect together. My stepmom had this one made for us. It's so soft. It's like crocheted or knit or something, but it's handmade. It's like the little holy, but it's purple. And I, I want to sleep with this. It is so soft. Daisy is, she will not go cold. That's for sure. And then my mother-in-law, her friend had this one made for us. It's got her name on it. I don't know if I can show it. Hopefully you can see that. <laughs> and close up, it's got little animals. And just different colors on there. But yes, that is so, so cute. I love it. So she's got lots of blankets and I think all of these are just perfect that, you know, we can keep forever and they're just good memories and keepsakes. So I think that's mostly everything. Other, I know this, I have this big gift over here. We got the um, Baby Delight Beside Me Dreamer bassinet. It wasn't really a baby shower gift. My mother-in-law bought this for us months ago. But I still wanted to include it. I'll try to put a better picture up here. Other big things that we got, but I wasn't going to carry up here. We got a Graco pack and play. It's not a travel one. Um, but we're going to keep it in our living room to make changing easier down there. That way we don't have to go up and down the stairs. So we got that. We also got a high chair. Um, which obviously we'll use like later down the road. But we got that as well. And this is the one we got. We also got a little activity center for when she gets older and she starts like walking with the activity center and she can roll around. Oh, and another thing I was so excited about is the, what was the brand? I don't have it up here, so I can't think of the brand. Fisher Price um, Swing and it's the flower one. Oh my gosh. I got that at my work shower and it was so pretty. I was so excited I got it. And at first I had the Mamaru on my registry but just looking at reviews and stuff, I had seen so many people swear by the Fisher Price one. You know, it's not like so much technology and I think, it, yeah, it's definitely cheaper. It was like $200 and it goes back and forth and it also can go front to the back. Um, but yeah, apparently moms swear by it. So I'll put that to the test and see if it works for my baby. So I think that's really all the, the main things that we got. I will show a couple clothes. Oh, yes, I will show a couple clothes. So, one of the ladies that I work with, she got her these, like, bougie clothes. Look at this box. It's from the brand Janie and Jack, and it had, like, this ribbon on it. Just the cutest packaging. Oh, my gosh, look at this. This little, like, London ear hat. Little bonnet. Oh, my gosh. And this dress. Oh my gosh, this one is so cute. I say that about everything. This little blue one with the bow and then it has matching pants. Oh my gosh. 
this next one is even more adorable. She'll be a summer baby, so she got her some little sunglasses. And to go with it, a little bathing suit. Oh my gosh, like how cute. So exciting, she'll be here. Okay, a couple more clothes I got that I thought were just so cute. Oh, look, I got another headband. See, I did get some. Little flowers. Rainbows. And I didn't get any newborn stuff. I got zero to three. I don't know if that's the same thing, but I don't have that many newborn stuff. So I'm kind of hoping, you know, I didn't want to go buy some just in case she's a big baby and then it goes to waste. So hopefully we are good on those. Oh, this is adorable. This little dress. Oh, and it goes, these little red shoes would be so cute with it. How adorable. Oh my gosh. So yes, I believe that's everything. I'm not going to show any more clothes just because I feel like that can get boring. Like I said, I need to get to organizing all of this anyways. So, and we didn't get everything that we needed from our baby showers. Surprisingly, I know that was a lot of stuff. You would think we did. But, um, so we went to Target last night, made a big order. I made another one online and I've just made several orders here and there. So I'm probably going to do another baby haul. Um, and I'll probably do it like a vlog style or something. So just keep a lookout and there will be another baby haul. I'm probably going to post a video of me organizing everything, washing clothes, organizing her dresser. I'm going to try to get started on doing all of that today. And hopefully this video helps somebody out there. You know, when I got pregnant, I started watching videos like this because it's so overwhelming. There's different brands and there's different, there's several different types of one thing. So it's just overwhelming. So it's nice to see what other people get, gives you ideas of things you might need. So hopefully this can help you out, help you build your registry or just watch for entertainment because I also did it for that reason too. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got some ideas and we are super blessed, you know, to have so many people around us that love us and support us and have just blessed us with, you know, so many things for our little baby girl and we can't wait for her to be here. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, I am trying to post a little bit more, but I'm getting towards the end. So I feel like I have more interesting things to show you. So give this video a thumbs up, comment, let me know if there's anything else you think we might need or things that maybe I don't need out of these. But anyways, thank you for watching if you made it this far and I will see you in the next video.